impressed that I didn't die. I was impressed that I died. It's a weird thing to be impressed by. Yeah, I realized as I was saying it, that wasn't going to end well. But you said it anyways, and we thank you for it. I figure that's what we strive for on this show. It's very Daniel Tosh-ish. You're Daniel Tosh-ish. No? Fair enough. Nobody's as Daniel Tosh as Daniel Tosh. That's true. Like, I'm going to argue that point. You might. It's not like I just argue to argue. Sometimes you do. You do. I do. I do that a lot, actually. <laughs> My verbal jouster, what can I say? No wonder your girlfriend loves you so much. She does love me very much. Yeah, she still got that voodoo doll. What voodoo doll? The one that looks like you. <laughs> I hope so. Wait, Why? I don't know. I don't well, know. She has a beautiful doll. replica. It's so she can take me everywhere with her. Oh, okay. <laughs> she never has to be without. You ever wonder what that stabbing pain in your back is? Negative. Okay. It's because he's tall and he bends over all day long. Yeah. Right. It's just it's just from my job is what it is. Yeah, that's the excuse I'd go with too. <laughs> What are you trying to say? I'm not trying to say anything. I'm just pointing things out. It sounds out. like you're trying to say something. Tyler, does it sound like he's trying to say something? Say something! Say something! Now, Mr. Riceroni, don't speak any English. You guys just became Chris Tucker. That's cute. Yeah, we did. Whatever happened to Chris Tucker? Um, Anybody? He's alive somewhere. I got that, thanks. He, he did a Netflix special not too long ago. Ooh. I say he still does stand-up, doesn't he? Uh-huh. I thought. I did hear they were trying to make a Rush Hour 4 with him and Jackie Chan. That's what I heard, too. I heard Jackie was the holdup, though. Yeah, that's what I heard, too. Like Chris signed on, no questions asked, without even reading a script. They're both getting pretty old, though. Yeah. Yeah, because I saw there was talk about doing a TV show, too. Kind of like they did with Lethal Weapon. Yeah. There was talk of doing a Rush Hour TV show. Which, I actually saw the Le the Lethal Weapon TV show. It's it's okay. I like the movies better, but I grew up well, with the course, movies. I say, of course you like the movies better. But they actually did a pretty decent job with the TV show. The guys that got to play Riggs and Murtaugh play off each other really well. Yeah. Whee. Some of those shows are now shows because they were movies. Right. It's hard to... To build a fan base because of all the people who mm -hmm. did watch the originals. Well, and Jackie They're, did a Netflix movie with... Uh, why can't I think of his name? Uh, Jackie did or Chris did? Jackie. Okay. Jackie did with uh, Johnny Knoxville. I, um, you know, I saw a thing about that. I just never saw the movie. It was not great. <laughs> oh, okay. From what I... I couldn't get into it. It was... It was just kind of one you of those. Take whatever was in there. I can't hold it. No. But it was, uh, yeah, so um, I, I mean. Okay. Jackie's definitely getting older. His stuff. Uh oh. Did you get stuck? Okay. No. <laughs> I was worried about it too. I was too. <laughs> yeah. Jackie's getting older though. It's kind of, I don't know if, how well he keeps up with. I mean, he's still in like great shape, but I don't know how much more of all of his action stuff he can do. I don't know, because he did one with John Cusack not too long ago, which was really good. John Cusack? Yeah. Okay. Hmm. I can't remember the name of the movie, but he he's like some old Chinese warlord or whatever, and John Cusack's a, a Roman warrior leading a bunch of people through the desert, and they get lost, and they meet up, and... Oh, fuck, this fight sucks. <laughs> Sorry, I was completely off But it was a good movie. I don't remember what it's called. It's like the Dragon's Blade or some shit like that. Hmm. Hmm. Never heard of it. I didn't either. It's pretty good. You sure yeah. it was it was Jackie and not Jet Li? Mm-hmm. Okay. Jet Li? Has he done anything in a while? I want to say yes. Last I saw him in was War with Jason Statham. That might have been it. You're, you're... What are you doing? Sitting in the electrical field. That was a good movie. That's the last thing I know he did, for sure. He did know. do the, um... What is it? Not the Untouchables. The, uh... Expendables? Expendables. The oh, yeah, that's guys. true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All the old action movie guys. I was... 
like I like those movies, but it it kind of sucked because he, especially in two and three, he had such a reduced role. Yeah, they they've kind of lowered his his role in him, which sucks. I mean, I don't know if that was his doing or what it was, but but those are good movies. I hear they're doing a fourth one. Wouldn't surprise me. Yeah, it looks like he did some Chinese movie last year, but the last one that he did overall before that was The Expendables 3. It looks like there's a place that you can climb. There it is. I gotta climb up here. Um, Problem is, I don't think I have the right arrows to fight this guy. Because he's a real pain in the ass if you can't knock his shit off. And I don't have any more of those arrows because I don't have the supplies to build them. So this ought to be interesting. Yeah. To try and fight him. It's not like you haven't had interesting fights before. Just stay hidden. Oh, every time you undo one, these guys come in? You only have to undo it once, but he always gets little helper guys. Oh, okay. I thought you had to stay climb hidden. like all three stay spots. Stay hidden. What are, are you a fireball? Yeah. Oh, you are. Never mind. This is, I was thinking of a different fight. Yeah, all you gotta do is use fire and just shoot him. Yeah. Helps if I hit him. Swing and a miss. Strike one. Whoa. Ball four. Ball eight. Ball, Ball 12. twelve. Man, how can guys lay off pitches that close? <laughs> I still love that that was an improv line. Yeah, it's pretty funny. Didn't he really do baseball announcing somewhere? For uh, the Brewers. That's it. I knew he did it somewhere. Need more arrows. He's a super funny guy, though. Oh, yeah. hilarious. Well, he's super funny in that movie, too. Good. Can't say goddamn on the air. Don't um, worry, nobody's listening anyway. So we got one goddamn hit. You can't say goddamn on the air. Don't worry, nobody's listening anyways. I need you to blow up, buddy. How do you get him to blow up? Yeah, because those aren't doing like any damage at all. No, they're really not. Alright, let's switch to these. Can you focus them again just to see? Oh god! There's something you're supposed to hit. Oh my goodness. Because you tried that Very last cool. time you fought one of these things and you could never get them to blow up either. I think I'm using the wrong arrows. Let's try these guys. These are supposed to hit a little bit harder. Yeah, they're hitting harder. Either that or you're supposed to hit underneath his belly. I did a lot of damage hitting underneath the belly. I did a lot well, of damage. If you can hit his that. little pouches, but they're supposed to blow up, and I thought if you shot them with fire, they were supposed to blow up. Faster. Well, can you do that scan thing and yeah, find out? Yeah, scan him with the focus. It'll tell you, right, if he's weak to fire. Nope, you got the right arrows. He's not weak to fire. Ow. At least maybe not this one. Well, he looks like he might be uh, about to burst. Firing up now. I can't tell if that's just residue from your focus or... It might be residue from the focus because it highlights... Weak points. Nope. There, there you go. Is. There it is. Got I the other side to blow. I knew he blew up eventually. You get the back one to blow too? Yep. Boom. There it is. Now it's just a matter of finishing the job. That would have been cool if that would have done it. That would have been. <laughs> not that. Get him one more. That's not going to hit him. He's way over there. <laughs> <laughs> she just attacks, man. Oh. Yeah. Wow. You dove into that and didn't yeah. get hurt. Yeah, so I was going to say, impressive. how did you... I, I was going to say, well, you dove into him, so that makes sense. But You're probably <laughs> going to want that coil, though, huh? There's a couple coils I'm sure you wanted. I Your satchel's that. full. I can fix that. <laughs> we'll drop that one. There we go. Okay, so now I can override a few more creatures after I do this little thing. What was this little thing? It teaches me how to override new creatures. A few more, or just this one? A few, you get like a batch. Oh. 
It should be this guy, the other bellow back, the ice one. There's an ice bellower? Yeah. How come we haven't seen that yet? We have. We just I didn't fight it. Oh, okay. <laughs> First core overridden. It should tell you somewhere. It should pop up and say what you can override. Sigma overrides available. So what do I have? Grazer, Grazer Sawtooth, 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 Scrapper, Lancehorn. Lance nice, the Sawtooth's a good one to have. Are you out? Yep. You also leveled up, and you're out. And I lost my mount. Well, guess we'll have to get a new one on the next episode. I guess we will. Are you in? Click subscribe. Press that like button down below. We are the Shadow Legion.